more of that deer bullshit and stuff. Crappy sound effects in my life. That's Miss Ruby's lair. To get in, you'll need that key on top of a pinky pedestal in the guard compound. Well, there's a bad mojo force field protecting it, so you'll have to destroy all five of the purple candles surrounding it. No problem. Don't get cocky or you'll end up with your head shrunk to the size of a pea. You've got to get past those photo guards, and I'm warning you, they're made and they work like a team. So do we, buddy. Okay, so these guys are like the ones in the boatyard level. Boatyard casino. Yeah, they're just as hard to get through. Especially in a level like this. Okay, so we got the vault ready, so this last guy get out of the way. That was pretty easy. If I did my math right, and I always do my math right, then the combination has got to be five eight eight. That was kind of weird to hear, but okay. So now if you do the roll, you'll be like electrified. I could have sworn he had no hat for a minute there, but okay. It looks like his hat disappears, but doesn't. That's weird. Key. Also, that candle birdie. There's still more candles. Right there's one. My paranormal scanner is maxing out on that structure. A reading like that can only be coming off Ms. Ruby herself. I think you're right, Sly. If you want to crack at Ms. Ruby, you're going to have to find a way inside that skull temple. Why are they always hold up in like giant towers that are kind of obvious and hard to get to? That's pretty stupid. Get this one out of the way. This is easy, but hard. Uh, you're not good at the whole uh, vehicle thing. You're not good at this. The only way to open up that voodoo gate is by lighting all 25 tiki torches with the flamethrower on your swamp skiff. Use the left analog stick to steer and press the X button to fire the flamethrower. Oh, and one more thing. You need fuel for the flamethrower, and the only source of oil are those piranha you see swimming around. Run them down with a boat. One fish fuels one shot. Hurry, you only have two minutes to get all the torches lit. 
This level sucks. So I suggest you throw over a few fish. And then play it out which ones you're gonna hit. Actually make it this time. Huh, we did it. Okay then. Time limits always make sure that I can have all the fun time. I think that was enough for this episode. Yeah, I'm gonna waste two minutes here. You know what? Screw it. I might even waste two minutes. See you guys.